What is up YouTube? This is another episode of Game Time and here we are playing just the the head-to-head -head seasons type online match in FIFA 17. I've been playing a lot of the club mode with my creative character online, playing with a lot of friends and doing the drop-in matches, but uh, I got to the point where I realized that I was just a lot better off by myself. I uh, obviously know where I'm going to pass the ball, what type of play I'm expecting, what type of movement of the ball I'm expecting and all that stuff. So I've jumped back into the head-to-head, -head, just one-on-one -on -one type stuff. I'm playing with Barcelona, love Lionel Messi. He is probably the best soccer player out there. Arguably, you know, Cristiano Ronaldo could be there, but uh, I love Messi. So let's get it going here. This is then the Manchester United lineup. As you guys can see, I don't know if you saw it on the other screen, my records, I think at this point, three and three, three wins, three losses. I started out pretty slow, didn't really know what I was doing, trying to figure out the way the game played and all that stuff, but uh, since I believe those first three losses, I've been on somewhat of a win streak here, so let's keep it going, hopefully. So my style of play really is just, you know, to try to take it slow, make good passes, don't lose the ball. A lot of people like to do these one-on-one -on -one jukes with, you know, their favorite players um, and just really try to create space that way and that's that's not my thing. So you'll see here, I'm, I'm pretty meticulous. Ooh, and there's a good shot there. Reacher, the goalie just barely got a reach on that one. So yeah, like I was saying, you know, it's it's going to be a very, uh, you know, honestly, slightly tedious, um, you know, effort here. Every now and then I do stupid stuff like that and just try to take a shot from deep for the heck of it. But uh, generally speaking, I'm, I'm going to bring the ball down relatively slowly, pass the ball around, look for that opening, giving, you know, a, an opportunity for my players to make a run and get some open space to uh, make that shot. Again, every now and then I will take some stupid shots that get deflected. Just, I also like to challenge the goalie here and there. You know, a lot of times you'll get goals off deflections, and you know, if the goalie makes a save but doesn't hold on to the ball, he'll uh, give your your team an opportunity to score. So I do every now and then just take a shot from deep just to see what happens. All right, so let's see if I can get the ball back here. Let's see if I can get something going. Alright, so I got a good steal, pass back to the goalie, goalie's going to kick it out, and I actually get it to my player, that's good, and I just throw the ball away. So that's a big thing in this game, you know, a lot of people just pass, get scared, pass, and throw the ball away. Hold on to the ball for a second if you got some time, actually look for that open individual. Oh, so here's a nice crossover, and the shot, and that was a pretty weak shot. Again, that one, you know, I, I could have passed it. I saw I had players there, so I just went ahead and shot it, hoping for the deflection. Of course, the goalie was there to get it. And same with that one. So, yeah, you don't always want to take those shots. I certainly need to uh, slow my roll on that a little bit because I've had probably four deflected shots already or blocked shots. All right, so I get the ball here, I pass it, and another just wasted chance. Oh, but I get the steal, pass it up, pass it up. Oh, here we go, this is going to be good, this is going to be good. There we go, there we go. Yeah, so that's that's huge too. I mean, if you've got a def uh, guy on your team running slightly behind you um, as you're entering towards the goalie, just pass it to that guy. It is, I mean, the goalie's obviously going to come to you since you've got the ball. That guy's going to be wide open. You will almost never miss that shot. All right, so I've got a 1-0 lead here. And it looks like we're really, really controlling possession here in this game. Nice through ball in the air to my guy and almost lost it i'm keeping a hold of it now i'm going to send it back and just try to kind of reset the offense here and that didn't work but he just clears it down and oh my goodness my goalie just ran away from that ball that could have been bad fortunately i had a defender there to help out and see again here we're just taking it slow taking it slow hold on to the ball and I don't take my own advice. 
Mascherano, fouled by him. So you just want to meticulously move the ball down the field. Slow and steady, hit the open guy, wait for the right chance. Like that, that's never going in. I'll admit I'll shoot those here and there. And I'll also admit it's a very stupid thing to do, but you know, you, you gotta you gotta stay away from that. You know, you wanna not only create your best possible opportunities, but you also wanna, you know, take those opportunities once they've been created. So let's move the ball down here. I got a nice through ball there, probably going back. Yep, there we go. And we're getting close here. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, and I lose the ball. So I know I mentioned it in the other video, um, the, the one-two passing is, is huge in this game. Being able to, you know, basically do a give and a go really gets your player wide open, really gives them the opportunity to create some space and get that scoring opportunity. I'm also not a fan of taking those shots from the outside, way outside the box, off to the far left or far right. That's just not going to do a whole lot for you. And the one caveat to that would be the, uh, I can't remember the name of it, but it's, you, you hold L1, or R1 if you're on PlayStation 4, RB if you're on the Xbox, and you either double tap circle or hold circle down and then tap circle again um, once the shot's about to be going off. And it's basically a forced uh, shot, it stays really low. It's, it's really hard for the goalkeeper to, to get. And it really allows for creating good shots in what would otherwise be very terrible situations. Turns a bad shot into a good shot. And I'll probably go ahead and do a video on that just to give you guys an idea of what I'm talking about. Alright, so let's move our way down the pitch here. Getting nice through ball action. Just playing 1-2, one, 1-2. Two, one, two. Back to the same guy. Let's take the shot from here see what happens. Oh, goodness. Good. So that was a good shot. I just put a little too much on it. That's all right. Again, we're still just completely controlling possession right now. We're controlling this game. I'd actually be surprised. I don't think the guy has a shot on goal yet. Might have had a, show, a couple errant shots, a couple of shots that are pretty far off target, but uh, I don't really get too worried about those. All right, we got great defense there on the cross and a terrible pass out, but he just ruins his opportunity with a weak shot. And it's now halftime. So I skipped over that screen a little fast. Sorry, I have a problem with pressing X far too much. But uh, I'm up 1-0. Again, definitely controlling possession here. Definitely controlling shots on goal. Definitely getting more tackles than my opponent. And those are the three big things that we need. Make sure we're getting that W and moving on to the next division. So I'm just passing the ball around right here, trying to find some space, trying to find something to do, take that shot. Again, God, my thumbs are so heavy. My thumbs are so heavy that when I push down, it just loads all the way up and just shoots it far over the crossbar. All right, so let's see here. Let's kind of look for an open guy. We got a guy down here. Oh, I should have passed that other guy. That was bad. They've lost the ball now. The opposition could get at them. Oh, the that time I laid off. I, I didn't hold the button too long. I thought I was going to get a good shot. Just not quite enough. That's okay. As you can see here, I've got 10 shots compared to his 7. I'm assuming the majority of my shots are on goal. His are not. So that's, that's going to be a, one of the keys to victory for me here. Really strong tackle. And the ball's gone out for a throw. Here comes Wayne Rooney. Momentum with him. I should have looked at the possession time or percentage. I feel like I've been controlling the ball a lot more than him. Oh, here we go. This is why I love Lionel Messi. He's just so quick. Yep. And because he's so quick, this guy's just going to go ahead and slide tackle him, knowing that he is not catching up to him. I'm surprised that wasn't a red. I guess there was someone in front of him, so it wasn't the last defender in the, you know, on the way to the goal, but... So it's pretty crowded right now. I'm still just going to keep swinging the ball around, trying to find an opening. On the attack here, Iniesta. Luis Suarez. Oh, we've got an open opportunity here. Oh, no, missed. 
We got a corner here set up for us. Let's see if I can get it in here. Oh, good defense, good defense. Oh, what is that? Oh. Thought we had a penalty there for a second, but it looks like that was just a foul on us. We get the ball back, get our possession, and we're driving again. Holding on to the ball, and we lose it. Ooh, and he's doing some fancy stuff here. But he's trying too hard not to steal it from him. All right, and we're moving back down the pitch the opposite direction, and we lose it. We lose it. Oh. Oh, All right, good work, Keith. That's the other thing too. Let's let's throw it out from the keeper. Roll the ball out quickly to our team if you can, and just start moving down the pitch. Create some opportunities for you. Try to get a little cheeky right here and trip the keeper, and that just doesn't work. No work here and there, though. I'm telling you, I love trying out weird things. Keep taking shots. Keep waiting for opportunities. One of those times those shots will work out. Or one of those times those shots will turn into a deflection and you'll get an opportunity off of that. Alright, let's get the ball out quick. Keep moving it down the field. Nice through ball right here. This is looking decent. Cut me off right here though. Oh, oh, oh. Damn. That was probably the weakest header I've ever seen. Oh, that was close. That was very close. Don't go up in here. Do not come up in here. All right, here we go. Now we're cooking with fire here. We're cooking with fire here. We're cooking with fire. Oh. See, that would have been a, a good opportunity for those, uh, one of those drive shots, the low drives to the opposite side, the opposite post. Totally botched that opportunity. Oh, man. Oh, man. That's right. We'll keep the pressure on. We'll keep the pressure on and just keep, keep taking our shots. Opportunities will come. Chances will work out. Just keep pushing. And it gives it back to it. When you think about football as a passing game, which it is, you think about players like him. Shots on here. Oh. The goalkeeper with a textbook save keeps the ball in his grasp. The home ground, not quite the fortress that the United fans hope that it is and expect it to be, really. But you never know. There's still yeah. time. Yep, not so bad for this guy. Every time he comes down, I just steal the ball and move it right back the opposite direction. Yeah, again. Again. And that's a corner. Oh, no. And that's even a goal kick. So, we're doing good here. Doing good. I wish I had more, more goals, but a win is a win. That is all I need. I just need the W. Trying to move on to those next divisions. most of the year in a confident style and really do look like they're going to get home. Well, just over 84 minutes gone. We'll see if I can get just watch. one more goal here. Oh, Messi's hurt. He's not paying attention. Barcelona still oh, here we go, Messi. Do something. Do something, Messi. Oh. But how strong he was. Crisp defending there. Luis Suarez. There's some potential in this move. On towards Messi. Messi! Oh, Messi! Goal! Messi! Goal! Alright, so we're up 2 0 now with the 89th minute. This game is pretty much locked down. Just gonna let the game get over and done with. I think that uh, Fowler might have been out of aggression, a little upset about the way the game's turned out. Oh, here we go. Messi again, Messi again. Oh. 
Oh, and he made a mistake right there. Do not, do not do that. I will take advantage of you. All right, so we got to go from Rakitic, Messi, and Suarez now. Game is three to zero. We are in extra time right now. Feeling pretty confident. There's obviously no way this guy's gonna come back. And that's game right there. We got the W. I'm feeling good. I'm happy. The team is happy. And now that is our fourth straight win. I believe. I need to check the records to see. That should be it. Definitely was enough. Oh, okay, so that was our finally our third straight win. So we started 0-3. We're now 3-0-3. Oh, and, and we've got enough points here to move on to the next division. There, I've got 18 shots compared to th 8. I had 12 shots on goal. He only had 3. I had the majority of the possession. More tackles. I mean, that was just a solid win. I mean, if you're winning in all those categories, if you're leading all those categories over your opponent, you are just going to have a much better game. Obviously, getting shots on target is ultimately going to lead to actual goals, and that's what I did there. Getting the upper hand of my opponent, winning 3-0. So I'm loading up for the next game here. I have four games remaining in this division. I think if I just win one more though, it'll push me over the edge. I think there's a certain number of goals I need to make that happen. But we will certainly be pushing for that. I'm feeling confident right now. I've been doing really well. Starting to get a really good feel for the game. Pretty good understanding of the way my opponents try to beat me and ultimately fail. So let's get into this next game here. That was an interesting game. A lot of my goals came at the very end right there. One of them was a little, actually I'm gonna be honest, the last two were, were pretty weak, but I'll take them, you know, taking shots a ton or what, what's gonna get you the opportunity. So, hey, we're into the next game here. Now on a three game winning streak, trying to keep that alive, keep that going. Already we got possession and we are in our opponent's side of the ball. And again, I'm just gonna, oh, I'm just gonna make a terrible cross, I guess. So we get the ball back, and now we're working it around, seeing what we can do. Take a good shot. Oh. Again, just test the goalie. Test the goalie, you know, see what, he's, see what he's doing. See if he's napping out there. If he's napping, that might go in. If he's, you know, just woke up from a nap, he's going to go ahead and deflect that, and you might get an opportunity to score. If he's wide awake like he is right there, then not much is going to come of it, but you miss all the shots you don't take. If you got the space, just go for it. There's a good good bit of defense there, thwarting their efforts. And that was just a tough spot there. There was a ton of defenders around. Didn't really know what to do. Definitely got stopped. Well, we get the ball right back. Oh, we're offside. Oh, if I just passed that just a second sooner, Messi would have been on a run straight to the goal. And the pressure there makes the opponent kick it out of bounds, so I am in the offensive zone again. Moving forward. And he Some steals the ball. The now and I steal it right back. So we're keeping possession just over just here. We're keeping ball over here. I'm Move working off. it around. Trying to get my teammates an opportunity. There's a shot. Oh. Damn, so those two good shots it took. Almost went in. Just not enough power on him. Not the right angle, I guess. Oh, another one. All right, well, already, again, right off the bat, I mean, I've got at least three shots, three shots on goal. 
I don't think my opponent's got a whole lot in the way of that. I'm definitely in control and possession again. Definitely taking good. Oh, and that was a freaking beauty. A beauty. So we're outside the box right there. Just drilling it. Check this out. Great pass to the center. And just a oh, nice curve on that ball. Kicking it to the far side. The goalie cannot get it. So now we got a 1-0 lead to start this game. When you go up early like that, it is, it is just huge. I mean, you, you control the game when you're up early like that. You know, if you wanted to, I, I, I don't do it. But, I mean, you could obviously just pass the ball around and take your time, big time, and really just take complete control of the game and let the clock run out once you got that first goal or that first lead over your opponent. But I'm going to keep going for more. Who doesn't love goals? So I got Leon Messi making a great run here. I'm coming down. That might be a penalty. Oh, wow, that was just great defense. Great defense. I would have loved a penalty there. Because I feel at this point, my possession is almost like 80%. I mean, I have had the ball the entire game so far. I'm just taking my time, taking my time, trying to make magic. That was nothing close to magic right there, but I get the ball back. And let's see what we can do here. Oh, trying to do too much with it. All right, so we get the ball back again. This guy is just dilly down. I mean, he's making it too easy for me to just steal the ball right off his feet. And I'm just going to work it around, work it around, look for my opportunity. Made a pretty bad pass there, gave up possession, but got the ball back. Oh. So my passing's on point, 85%. I like that. His is 57. I mean, he's just pretty much every other pass he's doing is just a terrible pass that I'm getting control of. Here we go. Oh. Thought I had a nice opportunity there for a lob through ball, but that didn't pan out. Kicked a little bit too far to the left. Ends up going out of bounds. But we end up getting possession right back. We got Lionel Messi here on the wing. Making a terrible pass to the defense. Dropping that passing percentage that I had boasted about a second ago. Again, dude just cannot hold on to the ball. So I take it back, and we're moving right back down into the offensive zone for us. Got a nice through ball to the wing. Make it through across here. Oh. Oh, this could be dangerous. This could be dangerous. Oh, again, he just tries doing too much with it. And I end up getting the foul. He gets the foul on me, so... We are in a good spot. We got 40 minutes into the game here, so halftime is quickly approaching. I got that 1-0 lead. I'm controlling possession, absolutely dominating possession. Oh, I'm feeling good. Let's see if I can get one more goal before half. Oh, not with a through, not with a cross like that. That was awful. All right, so he's moving it down now. But again, terrible pass. I take it, and we're moving right back the opposite direction. And again, I just make an awful, awful, awful cross. But again, he just gives up possession. He does not want to do anything with the ball. Oh, here we go. He's got an opportunity here. Get something going. He crosses it in, and I just kick it out. Get that stuff out of here. All right, so that's halftime. He's got no shots, no shots on target. I don't have too many either, but uh, I did get the one, one goal that counted, the one goal that matters.
definitely controlling possession. And this guy's taking his time to load back into the game. He's not ready yet. He's sitting there thinking to himself, what am I going to do? He's probably running off getting himself a coffee, an energy drink or something, because he's got to wake the heck up. We're playing for movement to the next division here. you got to take this thing a little bit more seriously, buddy. So we started the half 1-0. We had a goal from Alba in the first half. And I'm looking for more. Henrik Mkhitaryan. goes into the wider areas where they've got a winger waiting. Oh, well, there, no. That was probably his, his best opportunity there, and that just didn't work out to be a whole lot of anything. Give me that, give me that. Oh. If I got that, that would have been a great, great opportunity there. Ivan Rakitic. Sergio Busquets. Really trying to use the full width of the pitch here to make some progress. Well, they're building steadily here, working oh, away. Oh, that would have been another good now opportunity. they've got the ball back. What can they do from here? It's looking good, this move. Crisp defending there. Wasteful pass. Again, he starts to go in the opposite direction, trying to go towards my well, keeper, and he just loses possession, just pass. cannot keep control of it. i got Messi coming down the wing, coming down the wing fast. And what are we going to do with it? Uh, we're going to try to do much and do too much and just get the ball taken away. So we got a corner here. Corner's up. That was a terrible corner. I still get possession, though. I get the ball. I take a really, really weak shot. But again, just, you know, take, take shots. Sometimes those go in. Sometimes, again, they get to be deflected and you get an opportunity from them. So just... If you got an open shot like that and you're feeling a little wild, just go for it. All right, so I got possession again here. Now he's looking for support. Ivan Rakitic. Sergi Roberto. Just taking my time, trying to find someone. And he loses the ball again. We've reached the hour mark. Half an hour to go. All right, so he's got the ball on the wing here in his own zone, or in my zone. And, oh, nice. Nice deflection right there. That ball was definitely going towards the goal. Who knows if that would have been in, but uh, let's not take our chances. Let's just get that crap out of there. Ooh, a great, great cross off the corner. Great header, goalie's alert and getting that junk out. Another miss. Nice cross again on the corner. And the header just a little wide. So I need to keep the ball down here. These, these chances that he's getting now are starting to scare me a little bit. Oh. Practice in the throwing stakes for the goalkeeper after that. Sergi Roberto. And now Iniesta. It's good. Iniesta! Uh, Taking the chance with the shot there. Yeah, I thought he might have done better there. Had a bit of time and space. Good thought I had shot. that. I really thought I had that. That's funny, my keeper has three saves, and it's not because he's not doing a good job, it's just he doesn't have the opportunity to get, do the good job. We we're keeping the ball on his side of the pitch, keeping his goalie nice and busy. That's the way we want it. I'd love for my goalie to be bored. Bored is all heck. Oh, and that was just a wasted opportunity on me. I could have thrown the through ball in there. Didn't for some reason. I don't know what I was thinking. Been here. Well, we'll go ahead and pass it back to the goalie and just reset. Good stop by the goalkeeper. 
So let's have a look at the possession stat. So the possession stat has definitely dropped. I, I still feel like I'm completely controlling this game. I may not have had the ball for much more than 52%, but uh, I mean, I swear, I feel like the ball is always in my hands. Oh, and that just slips barely out of bounds. And I get it right back, right back. That's why I don't understand that we're at a 52% possession, but uh, I guess the numbers don't lie. Oof. All right, so we're now in the 78th minute, getting close to uh, that victory that will put us in Division 9 now. We're just trying to move on up, show the world who we are. So he made another offensive uh, attempt there, moving down, and it was just thwarted again, although I make the same mistake right there. Ooh, and this is looking a little dangerous. This is looking scary. All right. We got it back. And we are moving back down the pitch. The clock is running. Time is ticking. I would love another goal here. But I ain't going to get it doing that. So we're working the ball around. I thought I was working the ball around smartly, and then I make a poor pass. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Uh, he had some good defense right there on the corner. Completely just shuts me down. All right, so he is making a slight move towards the goal here. Oh, that was dumb. My goal is obviously coming out, getting that, kicking that crap out. We are now in overtime, extra time, I mean. We got the lead, 1-0, nothing big, but we are going to hold on to it. We're going to control possession right here. Oh, my gosh. I guess not. Alright, so just hold on to the ball. Don't do anything stupid. Don't allow him to create opportunities. I'm actually making a good move here. Oh, and goalie gets the ball. And just throws it out of bounds. And that throw straight out of bounds ends the game. So I've now won two straight. Actually, two straight in this recording. Four straight in total. With a 1-0 victory right there. I have the 12 points now to move on to the next division. I actually won the Division 10 title. So thank you for watching this episode of Game Time FIFA 17. We are continuing to move up in the divisions and we will continue to show you our journey on the way up. Make sure to subscribe to stay up on all the new videos. If you like the win streak and you want it to continue, definitely give us a like. And if you're at all interested to see my girlfriend play Until Dawn Rush of Blood in VR and completely poop her pants, click the video thumbnail in the bottom left. Thanks for watching. Game time is over, and I am out.